Today we've had a first aid lesson, the second first aid lesson for this group. In my experience, the, the children love it. It's, it's all hands-on. There's a little bit of sitting down and listening, but the majority of the program is hands-on learning for them. Right over the top, that way your body does the pushing rather than the muscles in your arms. In this day and age, you just never know where you might need those skills. Whether it's in the family home and you're the only person home with mum or the grandparents on a sporting field, somewhere that your knowledge might come into place. And now what are we doing with the hands? Good job. Tom has been teaching us doctors ABC. Danger, response, send for help, uh, airway, breathing and CPR. He does a really good job because he gets it stuck into our head. How do we check a response? Who remembers? When you do CPR on a baby, you use two fingers. The most important thing I've learned today is CPR. CPR is very important. On that spot, and then we lean right over them. So your arms are straight. Just being able to send for help at the very young age is, is really important. If you see someone lying on the floor, you should call 000. You need to call triple zero and tell them where you are and what has happened. You ring triple zero, triple zero. Hands towards me a little bit. Yep, perfect. Now push as hard. We start the program at reception, so from five, and goes right through to year eight, which is around 12, 13 years age. By the time they leave year seven, my hope is that they are quite confident and able to step in in an emergency. Our program's been created around how much they can take in, how much they can learn, how, how long they can sit still for. So we've taken all those things on board to create a program that's interactive, interesting, and they walk away remembering the important information. Thank you.